Hello YouTube friends, this is Recovering Yankee. Today is the 27th of first month, or January according to Rome. And uh, I'm still on a weight loss stall. That cannot be explained. However, I have watched several videos like I, said, I did the other day with coffee and um, I think the other one was... Anyway, today is the last day I'm going to drink coffee for a couple weeks and see what happens. Also, I'm intending to go on a three-day bone broth fast. Uh, many people have suggested that, and also some carnivore professionals have suggested that bone broth fast for 72 hours. So I'm going to go on that uh, very soon. Now, uh, I heard, but I'm not going to try it, that you could break a carnivore plateau or weight stall by going on a carb cheat day. I'm not doing it. I'm not giving up the benefits that I've already gotten. If I'm 251 and I eat some carbs today, I'll probably eat cheesecake if I do, or cookies or something like that. I just gain all the way back. I'll probably be 270 tomorrow if I do that. I'm not interested. Also, I want to um, uh, give you an update on my weightlifting progress. I'm doing good. I'm starting to see muscles pop through the fat, which is nice. Uh, or as my mother calls them, muckles. <laughs> uh, my arms are tightening up for sure. You can see the, you can see the different strands of muscles through my arms. Uh, I can make my chest, uh, my pecs move, and obviously uh, my shoulders are still kind of fat looking, but I'm making some good progress. Hold on. All right, so here's what I'm gonna do. Watch my chest. Is it shaking? That's my chest from my progress with weightlifting with my chest muscles. And now I'm gonna show you my triceps. So popping out a little bit. And biceps. See that? Oh, got a cramp. <laughs> anyway, thank you very much. Put it on pause. Okay, so thank you very much for looking at my uh, muckles, as my mother says. Um, obviously, I still have fat on my arms because the muscles are not showing through exactly like I'd like them to. And uh, the, the chest muscles are also not showing through as much as I'd like them to. But they are showing through, and that's, a, that's progress. Before, it was just pure fat. So I obviously uh, need, the, need the carnivore... Uh, to make me lose fat on my arms and my chest as well. And uh, it's, it can only get better. My muscles can only get bigger and stronger. And as I continue to work out, not only with the speed bag, but with the total gym, the muscles are going to start growing. I may not be able to get down to 165 because I've heard, I don't have evidence to support this, but I've heard from some carnivore professionals that your muscles actually grow even if you're not exercising when you're doing the carnivore diet because of the amount of protein you're taking in and the amount of fat you're taking in. So we'll see. I know it'll grow if you're lifting weights, obviously, but I don't think it, I have never heard of it growing if you're um, not exercising and lifting weights but still doing carnivore. I don't know. So we'll see. Actually, I don't know how I, can, how I can do that because if I'm lifting weights, I'm not able to do an experimentation without lifting weights. So, anyway, what I'm thinking, if muscles grow faster when you're eating high protein, by the time I get down to 165 pounds, I may be too muscular and be super skinny on the face. That's not going to happen. I also, if muscles are growing right now, maybe that's why I'm not losing too much weight. I mean, I'm stuck at 251. I have not moved. Uh, so tell me what you think. If the muscles are growing and that's why I'm not losing any weight, the girth is still disappearing on my belly, as you saw in the video previously. And uh, it'll only be a couple more days, I imagine, until I'm down into a size 42 waist. Uh, so if the weight loss on the scale is stalling, is it a possibility that the muscles are starting to grow and muscles, of, as you know, weigh a lot? So... Uh, anyway, give me, give me your ideas and your opinions. Uh, since it's my opinion and your opinion, I can, I can take your opinion as, as good guidance. Uh, and I can take my opinion as good guidance. So doesn't mean it's fact. 
Okay? So anyway, thank you very much. Peace. Hit subscribe and like too, please. I could use some uh, support. Thank you.